eso, bebé, lo que me hace, tú lo sabes muy bien. Dale, bebé, damos la calle, vamos a romper la ley. Estoy en ti, puedes confiar, llévate de mí. Mi baby, que te loca por mí. Hey lovelies, today I'm going to be using Talia Wajit's new Shea and Coco line and this line here is paraben free, alcohol free, as well as GMO, mineral oil and petro petroleum oil. So first I started off in the shower with the conditioner and it's just a cleansing conditioner. Then I'm going to leave, use the leave-in conditioner and I'm going to just spritz that all over my hair. And this product really just moisturizes and detangles and gets my hair like super soft. Now I'm just going to section my hair and you know how I like to do it into four sections. I start in the back first whenever I do any type of style. Alrighty, so I didn't want to bore y'all, so I already did um, most of my hair. And I'm just going to take Talia Waj's Curly Hair Curl Souffle and use this as my styler. And I'm just going to apply that from um, tips to root all over the hair. Then I'm going to go in with my Lotta Body Wrap Me Foaming Mousse. And I use this when I do like um, flexi rod sets and my perm sets as well. And I'm just going to use about three pumps and apply that all over to this section. So everybody's technique is different but to, for the look that I like I'm going to start twisting at the roots then I'm going to take the rod and to begin to twist and wrap around the rod so I'm gonna do this in normal speed so you guys can get like the gist of what I'm doing and then I'll speed it up and also when you're doing your um, perm rod sets or your flexi rod sets or any type of roller set you want to make sure that you're detangling as you go and that even goes for twist stuff as well because you don't want it to get tangled up at the bottom and everything so I'm just gonna wrap everything down all over the rod and if your hair is a little bit um it's shorter than mine you might want to not do it as like tight or close to because my hair is going to receive a lot of shrinkage also when i get to the end i just like to um wrap it around a couple of times and that's pretty much that so you're just going to make sure you detangle twist at the root and wrap around the rod and i hope you guys enjoy <laughs> All right, so this is the hair when it's completely done. And now I'm just gonna spritz some um, heat protecting all over because I did sit under the dryer for about an hour. However, I left these rods in my hair for about two to three days. So they were completely dry when I took them down. So now I'm just unraveling raveling the hair the way that it was curled up. And now you can just begin to see how coily it is. so my hair is hella short so we're just gonna begin to take the Manoy oil by um, Talia Wajit and y'all this oil is so great I really love this line and I'm just going to begin to um, pull on the hair and separate the curls as I go so when you put oil on your hand that's just ensuring that you um, receive less frizz and you don't have to like OD on the oil you could just use a, a small amount like a dime size even smaller than that and just begin to um, you know take out your hair so that you receive less frizz because nobody I mean frizz is cool but not on the first day so that's basically what I'm going to do and then you're just gonna style the hair to your liking after everything is separated and you can also pick the hair out as well So some pieces in the front did get a little frizzy like they didn't curl like how the rest of them did but I just fixed that by tucking it behind my ear and that was pretty much that so you could just play with this style and make it yours like you can just wear how you want I just picked it out so that I had more volume and that my hair was you know big and luscious and pretty so I hope you all enjoyed this video if you do use this style or do this style please let me know tag me in any pictures send me pictures I'd love to see thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video bye